answered APU, I think I went in thinking what a lot of people think, that I'm going to spend these next four years learning some good stuff, but when I'm done, I want to have a job. There's this unbelievably vicious cycle where these people are stuck. It's a situation that they find themselves in that's totally hopeless. And I, I find myself asking God, you know, where are you in this? And, and I sense that He's looking right back at me and saying, where are you in this? Studying in a place like South Africa, it has to change you. You have to be, you can't, you can't turn away from from that kind of experience and do nothing. Or if you do nothing, then you choose to do nothing. Studying abroad with APU in a place like South Africa, it removes the abstraction to the plight that a majority of the world has to deal with. I formed relationships with flesh and blood people instead of that obscurity known as the poor or the broken or the homeless. And I think that's really the point because obscurity is the enemy. As long as you hear numbers, you will consistently not be moved by statistics. But when I've made a relationship with someone, they've told me their story, its impact actually affects me because I see that perhaps my hands can do something about their situation. Studying abroad with APU allowed me to understand that people have a story and they have a name and they have dreams, they have aspirations, and that somehow through the grace of God I could play a part in helping those dreams come true, those aspirations to be realized. It's just something that I, I'm totally humbled by. So come on, come on, come on into the yellow light. So come on, come on, come on into the yellow light. This is it, right? Welcome to the Tempe International Thrift Store here in George, South Africa. Um, I'm pretty proud of it. Uh, most things that you see in the store have been uh, recycled, repurposed in one way or another. And we're excited to use this as a vehicle to pour into the lives of people who need jobs here. So, yeah, a lot of you know blood, sweat, and tears, but the final product is definitely something that we're excited about. And Something that we hope is going to be a presence in, in South Africa for a long time to come. So come on, come on, come on.